<laughs> it does feel weird, actually, when you, when you have a baby and you kind of step back for a little bit. Do, do you feel almost like a, a, a colliding of worlds, you know, when you... Yeah. When you you're doing a shoot, yeah. you're coming on this show. Yeah, you're right, a colliding of worlds, definitely. And that's what, I, I've said that actually, I think the ideal situation, if you could have it, is a parallel, parallel universes where you, I could be at work all the time, which I love, Yeah. and at home with my babies all the time. And how did it feel know? going back? Because you're <laughs> filming again at Corrie, aren't you, even though we've not yet seen yeah, you? Yeah, so weird, so I've been filming. I can't, I was just, I was so, scared to learn my lines. I mean, that was the biggest thing, because I just thought, you're learning lines, aren't you? Mm. Clean soon. Well, I'm trying. It's <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> not going in. It's, well, listen, well, don't have a baby before you do it. Oh. Because, honestly... <laughs> <that's>... <laughs> it really won't help. <laughs> honestly, I, just, I was so, so scared. Um, uh, but we have a little WhatsApp group, which I was still, I was still allowed to be involved with, uh, 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 Corrie, while I was off. So I was just messaging everyone, saying, I'm really, really scared. I'm really, really scared. Well, I don't think I'll be able to live my life. Just of, like, baby brain and Yeah, not just not quite... being able to remember my life. And just yeah. because yeah. you've come um, out of the habit of it, haven't you? you come out of the habit of it and your brain... Yeah, I think when you're doing it all the mm. time. But actually, it was just like riding a bike and I kind of... Just did it, and they kind of do that to you, Corrie. I think they do it on purpose. They're a bit cruel to be kind, so they just threw me right in. Yeah. Day one. Oh, that was there us in the bistro all day. I got a lovely pasta though. That was lovely. <laughs> um, <laughs> but if you're sitting down, can't you put little notes up against mugs and things to remind yourself? God, you could, I suppose, but then it'd be a bit it's cheating. It's isn't cheating. It? Yeah. It's cheating. Me. Uh, no, you're not allowed to cheat. So how does it feel now having a, another lovely new baby in the house? Yeah, you're no, loving it. I can't. You know, it feels like she was always supposed to be oh. here. Really. Yeah. I don't. I don't oh. actually know. I can't make that out. To be yeah, fair, I'm saying no. I don't um, know what it is. I think that's <laughs> that's, what that's my, that, there. Yeah, that. Was yeah, I think spider. that's my hand, his hand, and the baby. I think hand. it's hand in order of age. Oh no, Chris is older than me, so it's yeah. There we go. That's quite oh. an interesting name. Uh, like in modern day, modern, and did, yeah. did, uh, did everybody think you'd named her after Hilda Rock? Well, listen, I mean, yeah. the thing is, well, my boy Good came first. Yeah, well, my boy came first, Albert, and obviously there was a you know very famous uh, Albert Tatlock oh, yeah. in Coronation yeah. Street, yes. but also. It's also the name of our rival's um, square, which I hadn't oh. really thought about before that. Someone pointed that out. Ooh. Oh. Um, uh, so that's that. We did. I did that, and then yeah. Well, the thing is, there's no names that haven't been in Curry. That's a good point. That yeah. aren't, and and all those lovely classic names. Two two things about this name. I met a gorgeous, gorgeous girl whose grandma and granddad were called Albert and Hilda at one of the first oh. baby groups we went to. And then someone else said about the names, which I thought, <gasps> said, um, do you know what it sounds like? They sound like Albert and Hilda, two um, sweethearts writing to each other in World War II. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and obviously you've got one of each. Yeah. Are you conscious about kind of bringing them up in exactly the same way? Um, yeah, and I suppose... Yeah, I don't know. Not really. There's a lot of chat these it. days, isn't there, about you know bringing up boys to be a little mm -hmm. bit more kind of, I don't know, Open female in their feeling, thinking yeah. and vice versa, and that there's no such thing as, you know, predetermined gender roles, well, etc. No, well, there definitely isn't. There definitely isn't in our house in terms of, um, you know, mum, me and Chris and mum and dad, and well, in fact, Chris is much better at most things than me when it comes to the practicality of baby. Mm. Um, but I think the only thing with Hilda, and she's just got to get used to it, is in terms of toys, not gender specific, but they're going to be Albert specific. So whatever he's into, <laughs> yeah. she's getting tough. Yeah. You know? <laughs> and even What's the age stuff, difference? four years, four and he years. did a lovely thing. And he, he, even before she was born, so. Um, we, we tried, you know, talking to the bump, and he said, right, I am going to go and get baby lots of toys that she can have that were mine, but she can have them. So he made a massive box of them. He said, they're all soft toys that are going to be safe for baby. So this box is there in our front room. And from the moment she was born, it, it's dwindled, and now it's empty. He's taken them all off her. <laughs> So she's not responsible enough. She keeps breaking them. She doesn't take care of them. So Aww. now she's got nothing. Absolutely nothing. You recently posted a picture about with, with your stretch marks, with a stretch marks. Oh pitch. yeah, oh yeah. They weren't my stretch no, marks, but, but oh yeah, someone else's. Um, um, yeah, it was um, a campaign that Mother Care did, wasn't it? And I just thought, um, 
uh, and there was lots of pictures of of, um, of real of bumps. real yeah. bum, yeah. mums, and it was a beautiful picture. And what I just thought is, I was looking at it in my bedroom while I was breastfeeding my daughter and thinking that actually looks like my body. Mm. So I think that's brilliant mm. that, that that to celebrate women. And the most beautiful part of that picture for me was, I don't know if you saw it, there was a series of them, and this baby is just. Uh, woman, she's just in a bra, she's got her stretch marks out and she's holding her baby and the baby and mum are looking at each other. Mm. And it was the moment it's between the mum and baby yeah. that was the most important thing, you know, because... Can you see a difference? And obviously there's, there's four years since, the, obviously, the last time you were in this situation and, and the, you know, it, it is, it is a, a tricky time, obviously, mentally and physically, getting back to sort of where you were before. And I don't mean necessarily springing back, I just yeah. mean, like, going back to work and remembering your <laughs> yeah, life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you, have you seen a, a sort of sea change in attitudes and all that? Because there has always been the, will she spring straight back in? Do you yeah. think people are more accepting now in those so. four years? The thing is, I am such... Um, I, me and, there isn't one playgroup that me and Hilda haven't been to around our way. So, and seriously, I don't know if they are in all places, but the cakes are so good at the playgroups <laughs> that we go to. There's one, right, that I go to, and it's lovely, run by these women from the church, and it's uh, 40p, you get a proper cup of tea, in a, in, and oh, then you get a biscuit go. free. Do you have I mean, to have a seriously? Oh, yeah. No, no you could come. Come on. Come on, Hilda. Yeah, any time. Brilliant. Well, we, we, we've had kids just a little while ago. Yeah, <laughs> so there we are. <laughs> uh, Jenny, it is lovely to see you. Oh, You're upright. You. You're walking in heels. Life is good. Okay. Yeah. 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 Yeah.